Hello survivors and welcome back to another video. Now before we get into the video, as you can see, we are running on the beta version 0.1.0 and we got a little bit of everything unlocked, but we will get into that now. So before we start, here's the intro. All right, and we're back. So guys, let's just jump straight into it. So it was 117, I believe it was collections. So we've got a couple of new things that we need to unlock and we'll go through how to unlock everything and as how to unlock it as quick as possible. So first things first, there is a new Arcana. So to unlock the Arcana, we need to play on Christine and we need to get Christine to level 99. Once we've got her to level 99, we unlock the Wicked Season Arcana. Now what it does is it gives you your overall growth, luck, greed and curse are doubled at fixed intervals. Alright, these characters start gaining 1% growth, luck, greed and curse every two levels. Alright, now what it means is while you're playing, if you have a look under by my feet, it's now giving me more growth. All right, then once that runs out, it's going to go to another. Uh, let's see which one it goes to. So now I'm getting more luck and so on and so forth. And it just keeps cycling and it keeps repeating. Then next thing, it tells us we need to find the forbidden books. Uh, let's see if I can find it over here. Here we go. The forbidden scrolls of Morbane. Now this we would have seen inside the trailers we need to grab ourselves red death oops that's not him if you have him unlocked uh, if not then take crochi because he'll be the next best option we're gonna go to the bone zone and you are going to look for the question mark on your map so as you can see i've got a question mark over here on my map and we're gonna run straight for it now the reason we're running straight for it is that is the big clump on bones that we saw in the trailer if you saw the trailer if you never saw the trailer spoiler alert this is the big bones now he does always well, for me at least this is the second time i'm doing this and he unlocked he was at the bottom he does seem to just go left and right for me at least I'm not sure how it will happen for everyone else, but the best way to do it is to just grab a fast character. If you don't have Krochi or Red Death, then just grab anyone and try to get uh, wings as soon as possible. Alright, so we're nearly over there. Ah, that's him. So here is the big ball of bones. If you hit him, he'll still keep going in the same direction. But he just gets knocked back a bit so you're literally just going to keep smacking him smacking him smacking him and when he dies you will have unlocked the the, the book the forbidden uh what do you call it that item we were just collecting <laughs> sorry <laughs> uh the forbidden scrolls of morbane that's a new item guys you gotta forgive me with the names Anyways, that unlocks the secrets over here. Now, when you go to this, if you haven't unlocked all the secret characters yet, it will show you how to do it. So here it says cast the spell. So you're literally going to type here. Uh, you click over there, go X dash X one B I I Q, and that will unlock your uh, X dash if you haven't ever done him before. So just something like that. There are maybe other secrets. We don't know them just yet or what they do. But there will be in two new characters. The first one is Cosmos and the other one is Big Trouser. Okay. To unlock Cosmos. Oops, sorry. Let's go back to the secrets. It says to unlock him with a pure heart and two good friends. Visit the fiery balcony in Capella Magna. All right. Pure heart means no eggs, and two good friends are the birds. 
Now, a lot of people are saying, okay, grab Smithy and do it with Smithy. I tried this so many times, guys, it does not work. What you need to do is do not use any of the secret characters. All right, I tried with Pagnala, but it still didn't work. So I took Osolomio. It works with Osolomio. That's how I unlocked it. Uncheck your eggs. Put max weapons to six. Get rid of Limit Breaker. Get rid of Arcanas. You can play on Hyper Mode. That's fine. You're going to go to Capella Magna. And what you're going to do is you're going to just run. You can level up at the bottom. That's fine as well. But as you can see, this little fire, the NFT is what we like to call it. Uh, the little fruity, the torch fruit. You're going to run to that balcony. All right. Now, there's nothing else that you need to get except for the two birds. You need Blackwing and you need the Ivory Bird or Ebony Bird. Sorry. So you just got to hope that you have the RNG. It took me a really long time to get it because my RNG was really bad. I kept dying or whatever the case may be. You know, it, it's not something easy. Also, I did not use any banishes, so I have not tested it. I don't know if you're allowed to banish anything because it does say pure of heart. Pure of heart, everyone was saying, you know, it's just uh, the no eggs. But I had to do mine with no arcanas, no eggs, uh, no limit break. It, it was just crazy. So this is just... Just to be sure, you know, you're going to run here. So here's the NFT. Guys, if you do not see Cosmo sitting over here, the actual character, then you have done something wrong and you need to look for it again. So everyone should have five rerolls and 10 skips. I just rerolled until I landed up getting the birds, which I don't, and then skipping until I got them. So I just used my rerolls and just used my skips. You don't need to worry about the NFT. You can pick it up if you need to kill things around you. And once you have both birds, regardless of level, this balcony will open up and you just need to walk into Cosmos and you unlock the bird. Okay, you can uh, level up your dusting. dusting. That's fun as well. And you just got to grab the two birds and the balcony will open. So that's how the quickest way to unlock Cosmos. And it also just gets rid of all the confusion around how to unlock it. Next, the other secret is to master all 16 accessories in Moonglow. Moonglow. Now, the best way to do this, or the way that everyone's doing it now, you know, is taking gains. You can activate your eggs and everything again. Limit break, Arcanas. And we go to Moon Glow, and the first thing you're going to do is grab Mad Groove. Now, when they say Master All 16, they mean grab every single one of the accessories. Oh, okay, I've discarded the one there, but you get the point. You're going to grab all of them. Okay, and that's it. Now you just need to level them all up to max level. Once you've leveled them all up, uh, you just go options, quit. You'll hear the noise on this screen uh, to say that you've unlocked the new character. All right. Now, last but not least, let's actually get into the characters. So first we've got Cosmo. Cosmo Pavoni gains one recovery and one luck every level. Gains one revival every 100 levels. And he has hidden weapons. So I've never actually tried to play on him. So let's just go and see what hidden weapons they are talking about. Uh, it might actually be very good to get Wicked Season on him. But that would only be at the very end. Now as you can see, he actually has no weapons on him. But he seems to have started with both birds. So that makes me think. And actually, while we are talking about the character, let's just quickly see if he might. Okay, well, that actually you ha can not go to zero max weapons. So he starts with both birds. He starts off with Ebony and Ivory Bird. 
and you get one other weapon of your choice. So you could theoretically use Silent Alt Sanctuary with, uh, let's say, Vandalier and whatever other weapon you want, and it would only count as having one weapon. Maybe not. Maybe it doesn't level up the birds. So he just starts off with the birds and that's that. Then you get an extra weapon. Next, we've got Trouser. Big Trouser gains one greed every level and gold fever lasts longer. And he starts off with the candy box. Okay, appearance in level up options is affected by luck. It allows you to choose any unlocked base weapon. So if we play with Trouser, go one max weapon, bam, you get to start off with absolutely any weapon that you decide to play. And as you can see, with a little bit of the cooldown reduction from Silent Vault Sanctuary, a little celestial dusting, <laughs> farting out flowers from the, the clown is pretty funny. Really cool character, really cool design. So, so that's uh, the character. That's how we unlock them all. I hope this helped you guys unlock everything as soon as possible for yourself. And I hope it helped clean up the confusion about unlocking Cosmo. If you have any other questions, please let me know down in the comments. Otherwise, please remember to smash that like button and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. And always remember, keep safe survivors, and I'll see you for the next one. Cheers.